We are back with Suicoden Tactics. We just beat our first real battle. Now, I mean, I guess our first, I don't know, proper mission. In any case, I did get something really quickly. We have, well, I'll show you. I don't know who I want to equip this to, honestly. I don't know how much it matters. Hmm. Can I see stats? Oh, I can? No, it just says level. This is equipment. Oh, status. Here we go. Okay, I see what we're doing here. Alright, you know what? Let's do this. Let's change equipment for Andark. Maybe it's an other thing? Yeah, gold metal. Pumps defense a little bit. You know what's really strange, is you get a super reward for the S ranks, but otherwise you get more, I guess, of a pity bonus if you get silver and bronze medals. The gold is the most brag-worthy metal, but it's the least actually effective. If you can't get S ranks, go for bronze, which is weird. Hello there, Insane Buffoon and Winterburn. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? I don't know if there's much more I can learn in terms of skills. I don't know if I can pump this stuff. Yeah, nope, not happening. Sorry. No. This is a big fat no. I, I could learn counter-attack if I wanted to. I might hold off. I don't know. So, uh, do I just select Enter the Nest of Pirates? With the moving on? Yes, I do. Kika, I'm going. Don't worry. Edgar, that's all you ever say. <laughs> but I always come back to you. Edgar, this pirate has made quite a name for himself. Let's proceed with caution. It is too weird to see Brando just being a guy. Like, he's just hanging out instead of being this crazed rune of punishment monster. All right, Brando. Are you serious? No, it'd be certain death. But first, let me review Dot Hack Infection on the Toonami block. No one will blame you for backing out now. Why don't you just go doze off like those other two over there? If we're risking our lives, so be it. Please, let us join your fight against Steel. I beg you. Hmm. Well? Gah. <laughs> Gah. Suit yourself. Thank you. We won't let you down. <sighs> Fools. All of them. <clears throat> well, I'm going to go with them. I'm going along as well. Me too. Me three. Seneca, I need you to stay here. Never mind. What? I want you to wait here with Kirill. In case we don't return, I trust your judgment. The only thing I ask is that you watch over Kirill. But father... Kirill, promise me, if we don't come back, you must pursue the rune cannons in my stead. I... I promise. They're gaining ground by the minute. Let's go. Oh, it's like that Sega Genesis game, Gain Ground. Clearly that's what he's referring to. Please, be careful. Don't worry, we'll be back.
Huh? Carol? Carol, where are you? <laughs> you had one job. I'm gonna want you to watch over Kirill. No problem. My controller is rumbling. Everyone ready? <laughs> I hope those scum brought their own coffins. Alright, like I'm gonna be real with you, dude. I'm gonna I'm gonna assume that they did not bring their own coffins. Yeah, I think still scary. Father, be careful. Carol. Yes. I told you to wait for me. What are you doing here? I I'm sorry. Are you sure you're prepared for this? Yes. Oh hell. Okay then, but keep to the back of the ship. Yes, sir. Don't make me come after you. <laughs> the Night Sea. That's a cool looking skull in front of that ship. Get a friendly unit next to the rune cannon. Or lose with Walter. Lose Walter. I don't think he could die, but he certainly can withdraw. So setup menu. The Senate goes out. I, I can't put her into this, so oh well, shucks, gee golly. Oh, support actions. Units with mutual goodwill and certain other units may be able to protect each other if attacked. Protected units take only half damage. Also, mutual goodwill may allow units to assist when a friend attacks. Up to three units can join an assist. The more units helping, the more damage they do. The probability an affected area of supporting actions rises with goodwill. So, have units hang out next to each other? Anyway, let me hit circle, right? Yeah. How do I... Well, this is the the turn order and everything. I forgot, how do I pan? Maybe I'll just do status. Or, you know, not select. It is not select. Ah, jeez. I'm just trying to get a load of the various units. I do not want to stand by. Whatever, I just do move. All right, so where's the rune cannon? It was at the front of the ship. Where is the rune cannon? It's the creepy eye, right? Where the hell is this thing? Oh, is it, is it just this? It's just this? Oh, it's not as far out as I thought. All right. And do I have the game book? Yeah, I do, but it's fine. Everything's fine. All right, so let's move for real. I could really go after any of these pirates. Uh, Brando is primarily water. Pirate is water. I mean, I guess the elements don't really matter. Just that I'll be dealing with them. Let's get them in here. And I'll attack with this guy's flank. You didn't finish him, Brando? Is this some sort of horrible, horrible joke? Alright, you. I cannot move very far, can I? Whatever, you can easily finish this guy. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, peck? You know what? Why not? Um, where can you go? There really aren't many places to go, huh? Well, 
there's Kiro. Maybe I should stay in the back. I'll move over a little bit. Oh no, be careful everybody. Seven damage, you dastardly criminal. This guy's not gonna get much done though. It just missed. And I countered with Brando. Sit down, buddy. Just give me free XP for... Well, I was going to say for nothing, but that's what free XP means. I do not want an enemy near the room cannon, please. Can you attack from here? No. Oh, yeah, that's right. Rune. Lightning rune. Yeah, Thunder Runner. Ugh. The perfect... Oh, I, well, I can move, actually. Let's do that. Now let's see how you like Thunder Runner. Oh, now we're talking. Yeah. Oh, is it because of the element? That was not effective at all. These guys are regenerating with their particular elements. Heck, I don't know what to... Yeah, heck, I don't know what to tell you. Can I... I can attack from here? Well, damn, all right, we're doing this now. Thank you. Jolly Pirate, don't care. Rowdy Pirate, don't care. Oh, the, this'll this'll end the turn. I win. I didn't take out every enemy, but I didn't need to. Now let's hold here for a moment. If we could get our hands on that device. Um, father. Ah, what's he up to? Does he think we can't see him from here? I know I said this last time, but my god, what a profile picture. That's incredible. Well then, he'll be our bait for today. Watch and weep, boys. Whoa. What's that fool up to now? Father! No, it's too dangerous. <laughs> the profile picture changed. That's less than good. Wait. Whoa, that's what that is. I did not expect this. That's a new kind of rune. He's the most powerful kid in the game. He just pushed past Brando. What? Their father and son? This is too good to be true! <laughs> father! It's me! Carol! <laughs> Brutal. No! Oh no. Walter. If only I'd failed the mission. Scene. <laughs> you fiend! 
careful, Edgar. Peck, we need to hit Steel head on. Oh, I think they can. We'll keep him occupied while you do something about that device. Got it? Yes, sir, Mr. Brando, sir. I'm counting on you, Peck. Don't let me down. Eh, I don't remember Peck being in Suicoden 4. I mean, that could mean anything. Brando went crazy and started taking everybody out. The Night Sea. So we're still here, of course. Defeat Steel or everyone else. Interesting. Uh, I, like, again, I don't think there's much I can do with the member list. Okay, we open with Brando. I doubt I'm going to be able to pull off an S rank, but I am curious. Brando might just have to get in there. Let me zoom out. It steals all the way back there. What a pain in the ass. Actually, wait. Brando's got movement. Gotta say. It's annoying because I want to get in the middle of all three of those guys so I can do extra damage to one of them, but then I'll be surrounded by those guys. Let me see what Peck's movement is. That's Jolly Pirate, Rowdy Pirate, Peck. Can't tell what the movement is. Curses. Pain in the ass. I would like to get close to steel, but that does not seem to be reasonable. Ugh. Why is it not quite enough? Ugh. Oh well. Now we're talking. I like that. Of course he's going to catch you from the side. Oh, no, he's going to change elements. Oof, a back attack is unfortunate. Watch out! Oh, protect. Two damage. You know what? I think I could take two damage. Hello there, Oats Monkey. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? I'm getting wombo comboed by dastardly pirates. Oh, Jolly Pirate gets a back attack. Now we're talking. Okay, there are too many enemy pirates. I am not a fan of this series of events. I didn't have movement. Please don't kill Mr. Jolly Pirate. I'm trying to live here. Yeah, more of that, please. Hero can't do anything. Okay, and Dark will... Hmm. Lightning Force. That'll do for now. That's a load of XP. You've got to be kidding me with this. Can I, like, not lose Brando? Here comes Steel now, who just sits there, fortunately. Do I only get to control Brando and Edgar? I have, like, 100 characters, and I have to just 
sit back and wait for all of them. Ugh, this sucks. Maybe it's because of their elemental affinity? I don't know. I can get up here, though. I can just hit steel. It'll be head-on, unfortunately. But I can just get over there. That is not good damage. I was expecting better than nothing. Also, now that I've moved that guy out of the way, there's no longer protect. So Brando might be in actual trouble. And once they get rid of my jolly pirates and all that, I'll be, I'll be in real trouble. Maybe I should have focused on just taking out the mooks. This sucks. I can't believe I'm going to lose freaking Brando. This is ridiculous. Now you've done it. I might just do a retry. They got me. Kirill is 100% dead. Stand by. Actually, you know what? Rune. Thunder Runner. I'm gonna move slightly. Better. Well. Excellent. Yeah, I think I lost this, though. By a lot. By a lot. Oof. And Brando's just chilling. And here's the new enemy. Which means I'm screwed. Brando can't go anywhere. Because he's being body blocked. Nah, I got the guy, but I'm freaking dead. These guys can pump themselves all they want, but uh, Kirill's dead, man. Uh, Edgar can move somewhere that is... Behind steel. There we go. How do you like me now? That's proper damage. But Kirill's gonna <laughs> drop. Forgive me, Mr. Brando. Is Peck, like, actually dead? I gotta look up how that works. Oh, just give up? Okay. Uh, continue. What, is Peck not... Was I supposed to protect Peck and Kirill? Yeah, okay, I'm not allowed to lose Peck, that's what it is. Whoops. Curses. Ah, what a pain in the ass. I didn't realize I had to protect Peck. It makes it harder because I can't control him. Maybe I should just focus on goons, then. What a nuisance. I'll get Brando to line up up front, then. No, you know what? I'll, no, I'm going to change things up. I'll put him between, or among, all the goons. And then I'll, I'll just start getting cheap shot damage. You already got one, right? This is how it's done, hopefully, maybe. And I'll face other goon. Edgar... Get in there. This angle's a little difficult. That might be the best he can do. I could get Edgar over here and have him fight other goons, perhaps. Maybe I should just have these guys tank everybody. 
because this is a, a very annoying amount of enemies. A very annoying amount of enemies. So they're not going to protect each other, but at least they can... Good job, dumbass. Alright, whatever. Couldn't finish one guy. Heck, I have no control. Axe cast. Whatever element that was. Maybe fire. And dark, I will, I will still use lightning force on self. Uh, face forward, I don't freaking know. Oh no, a back attack on Jolly Pirate. You monster. Watch out! Oh, sweet, there it is. Three damage. I owe you one. Mediocre damage. I, I still wonder if I can actually get steel, though, if I act even more hastily. You leave Jolly Pirate alone. Okay, he's out of here. Again, I'm tempted to use Thunder Runner here on these goons. Because, like, I, I know I'm supposed to get the guy who spawns in behind me, but these guys have got to go. I appreciate that back attack. That's something, right? Kirill's out of this. And now they have the guts to go after whoever that is. Steel weights. Oh. Jeez. Do, do you know what that was? Do you know what that was? That's lore, is what that is. Ugh. Again, I have no choice but to attack steel from the front, which is why I super don't like this. Every little bit helps, man. If this doesn't work, then on my third attempt through this level, I'm gonna go after the goons. I can't get behind him. I can flank him. But this guy's really suffering from damage here. Y YOLO. That is not sufficient. Oh god, alright, it's all over. I have failed this mission already. Hello there, Falcophon. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? No, not that guy. Alright, well now Peck's out of luck. These pirates have good movement, unfortunately. Bows are the worst. Yeah, that is Peck. I think uh, I'm out of luck for this one. Again, I can just Thunder Runner these guys. That's gonna hit Peck too, though. Ugh, alright. Again, I'm gonna have to move a little bit. They're positioned in a way where I can't get as many as I would like. That's very annoying. Like, this is... Ugh. Whatever. Ugh, not ideal at all. At least, like, I took some more poison damage. I think Edgar's... Edgar parried it? Well, damn. Steel's unbalanced? I was not expecting this. Too bad I'm gonna lose in, like, a second. And here comes the new enemy. Brando. Get behind Steel. Actually, no, that's not true. Flank Steel. Oh, well. He's unbalanced, though which does not appear to affect my ability to damage him in the slightest. I got an assist, but like, one damage. This is a joke. 
This, this just full on sucks. I got a crit, but like too little, too late, dude. Peck is dead now. Are this pirate's actually going to assist? Elemental change, probably not good. Yeah, he's regenerating him. I'm, I'm out. And Peck's dead anyway, so it doesn't matter. Precisely enough damage to kill him. Ugh. Alright, to hell with this. I'm killing his goons. I was hoping I could rush and get a good kill against Steel, but I don't think it's happening. The thing is, I think continuing actually lets me maintain the experience that I took in previous attempts, so I could grind this level? <laughs> But yeah, very unfortunately, I think I'm going to have to settle for just taking out the enemy units, the other enemy units. Uh, Brando, once again, Brando will take this side, I guess. I'll just tackle this guy head on. It, it kills me that he can't deal enough to finish the job. Oh yeah, I tried this before, right? I flanked this guy and it wasn't sufficient. Unless I crit. Did I get him? No, I got him that time. And I got a meat bun. Sweet. Heckle chill. Pirate axe will... Go for Brando. And actually get a proper hit. This sucks. Elemental shift. Very annoying. Jolly pirate, go get him. Or, you know, not. Rune. Lightning force. You're supposed to parry, Edgar. You're supposed to parry. Okay, well, no one's parrying a bow and arrow. I'll take the counter. Wasn't enough to kill, though, very unfortunately. Can you imagine how embarrassing it's going to be if freaking Brando drops? Now, there's a parry. That's what I'm talking about. And now Edgar's out of here unless he uses that meat bun. Almost drop right there. Pathetic. Alright, Brando has his work cut out for him. Mr. Bow and Arrow. You are so done, buddy. <laughs> I've left a path open for the other pirates, unfortunately. I'll take that. If this guy wants to be a human shield, I'm fine with that. Item. Where the hell's my meat bun? Does it not count until the level's over? Well, I'm using medicine. Boom, like it never happened. Oh no! Ack, he says. Could we not? Could we not go after Peck? Ugh, I have to send my guys back now. This is a weirdly difficult mission. This is so early. Oh, hello there, Magnum RPG. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? Oh, look, I get to do something. Um. I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll try this. I know I should probably be saving my Thunder Runner for, like, whatever that new enemy is. But this is such good positioning.
Oh, no, it's really not. These pirates position themselves just a little too well. A pain in the ass. I guess I'll move over here? It's not ideal, but I don't know what to do here. Yeah, here's scary enemy. Whatever the hell that thing is. Steel just chills. Brando's gonna have to get back and start saving lives here. This is unfortunate. Yeah, Brando's looking good with that elemental stuff. Didn't have a chance. Brando even got a little healing because he's on the proper element. I like that part. There we go. Stay away from my captain's kid. Okay, now maybe I'll use Rune Thunder Runner. Can I hit this creepy uh, new enemy here? I can. I no, that's Carol. <laughs> um... Let me see. I don't know if I can do this. My movement really isn't very good. This is absolutely not happening, so I'm just going to stick around. Really? Oh, good. We got the counter. Did it kill him? Yeah. All right. Free turn. Axeman wants to play games, though. But did he just make it better for Brando, too? <laughs> Again, one damage, but... Oh, he didn't punish. Alright, too bad. Steel waits. Creepy Fishman. He's just called Fishman. I don't want that guy getting much closer to me. There we go, let's get a back attack. Let's see your elemental affinity save you now, buddy. Oh, Edgar actually can get involved. This is good. Not enough, but that was good. Now, let's, uh... Make some fried fish, I guess. Yeah. Oh, nice. I mean, I stunned the guy, but like, are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> I guess if I ruined his uh, day with a poison, it's something, right? And Steel's got nothing to do. Fishman's stunned, I guess. And he's further taking damage. You know what? That's something. Okay, no more scary pirates, and I have a meat bun. We're not getting back there in time, I'll just uh, take the heal. Or I'll take the damage, because I'm a fool. Fishman is no longer stunned. Does not attack. That's a bad element. I can't really move much. Got him! 
Bonito. Well, I beat the mission. Damn. Yeah, of course it was a B rank. Not ideal. I got a silver medal. Cool. That was no joke. I would have loved to have just rushed steel and taken him out. What now? At a time like this, to hell with this worthless contraption. Looking for a fight? Playtime is over. I wouldn't do that if I were you, dude. We know what happens to that rune. Something's happening. Run! So long. Wow. So this is how it happened, huh? No. No. You bastard. What have you done to me? <laughs> My gift to you. The rune of punishment. Most cursed it is. It devours human life. One day, you too will be consumed by it. Yeah, he's right. An accursed rune. <laughs> no, Edgar. What the hell happened? Peck. Your Peck. What... What happened to you? What? What the... My hands! They look like... Corpses! What does this... Wait a second. Was this the guy, like the, the Weasley guy who was with Brando in City Code 4, who was like, Don't do it, you fools! He'll kill us all! Stop surrounding me! Was that him? Are you absolutely sure? I'll follow wherever you lead, Mr. Brando! All right, then. So be it. Let's go. Yes, sir! Your wish is my command. Damn, that may, that completely recontextualizes the opening of Sui Coden 4 then. So Brando had just had enough by that point, and Peck was like, wait, I'm not ready to die though. Uh, 
Kiro. Thank you for your help, Yon. Kirill, are you okay? He must be freezing. We'll get you back to the ship soon. Hang in there. Walter, give me the strength to go on. If I lose Kirill too, I... Mr. Brando. Good. Let's go. Are you sure about this? Shouldn't we at least see Lady Kika before we go? No. I don't have the right to. What could I say? But that's... Forgiveness. Salvation. I am beyond these things now. All I have is this curse. We must leave. Now. Yes, sir. No way, Tario. Lady Kika, this is Edgar's... <gasps> right? Shut your trap, numbskull. Think about how she must feel right now, and keep quiet. Edgar, you did come back to me. Edgar. Don't ever leave me again, Lady Kika. Oh, Edgar. Edgar. No kidding, three years later. Kirill's injuries were worse than we thought, and he needed much time to recover. It has been three years now since Walter's death. A great war raged between the island nations and the Kuluk Empire, all because of the accursed rune of punishment. Then, thanks to a heroic young leader, the island nations banded together to take the Kuluk Empire head on. Yeah, this is Sui Koden 4. They Fort El Il, the Kuluk Empire's southernmost base, and a temporary truce was reached. What you riding, huh? What? Come on, no need to hide it, is there? Oh, I bet there's something juicy in there, huh? Juicy? Don't be ridiculous. It's just a journal. Oh, really? I'm serious. No peeking. Mm-hmm. Yon sure is a strange one. <laughs> You're saying this three years later? I mean, she's been watching over Kira like that for how many years now? I wonder if that was Walter's dying wish. I suppose in her own way, Yon understands who the leader of this group is. Hmm, good point. 
Well, thanks to her, Carol's looking a lot better lately. I think it's about time we set out again. Actually, I've been thinking the same thing. We should probably find some work soon. It might take our minds off what happened. What? Off of what happened? It's been three years. Like, I know you're not going to necessarily get over it by three years, but like, oh, we should find some work to take our minds off. Like, yeah, you should have been doing that. Yeah, good idea. Walter may be gone, but I'll make sure Kirill doesn't suffer the same fate. I made a promise. Well, don't take all the credit. I'm coming along too, you know. After all, I need to keep my eye on you. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Just kidding, silly. Oh, okay. Sometimes you can just be so clueless. Hey, and don't go writing anything weird in that journal of yours. Of course I won't. Alright, at long last I have control, other than, you know, pressing X to advance conversation. Let's go to the system menu and save our game. I do have a bunch of potch now. Man, I can't believe I didn't get an S rank. Wow. Alright. We have finally made it here. This is kind of unreal. I want to see something uh, unfortunate. Let me go back. Party menu. Uh, let's, let's do skills. Kirill is E rank with parry and counter attack. Instead of S rank. Ugh. Ugh. That's as good as that's gonna get. Um, battle lust, increased number of attacks. A critical hit, better chance. I'm gonna go with battle lust, I think. Whip. Boom. Now we're talking. Um, otherwise, what else can my other characters do? Nothing much. Where's guard? There it is. Oh, I can level up guard. Alright. Seneca. I think we're just stuck with this. Ah. <sighs> Alright. You know what, I should have done this the first time, but I got so excited because I finally had that chance to save. You do not want to forget to save and then turn the game off. Remember, cutscenes are unskippable. I can mash through text to the best of my ability, but I can't skip cutscenes until New Game Plus. Oh well. Anyway, let us enter Razril. Remember the... I can't talk. I was going to say remember that name. So, uh, let's go. Outfitter, Rune Master. I actually have Potch at this point. So, Backstreet's Outfitter? Welcome. That's a lot of other. That's a lot of other. Otherwise... <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Rune Master. Hello and welcome. Viper Orb? For one handed swords. Huh. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. Men's of the Clothes. Rage Force Speed. Changes terror. Okay, tearing elements to that thing. Fair enough. I think this is gonna be one of those things where I'm gonna have to like enter and leave the store to hope for cool stuff. I don't know if I have to go back to the caravan to do this or if I just get lucky with this stuff. Like, what if I go back to the caravan? What if I do that? And then what if I go back to Razril? 
This is one of those obnoxious things that I really shouldn't have to do, but I can. It's still rage, though. I don't know. How vexatious. I might be just kind of, like, stuck with this. Um, otherwise... I'll try this one more time, and then I will actually advance. I do like the, the background image here. Like, yep, that's Razrael. Eh, to hell with it. Alright. Um, anything to buy that's good? Leather armor, I guess. Whatever, man. Other gloves. Thank you. Thank you. Caravan. Party menu. Equipment. Leather armor. It's just a little better. And Seneca. Mittens. Two leather gloves. They're just better. Extremely mediocre, but whatever. Welcome. Yeah, alright. Thank you. So, gossip. Young boy. Razwell has recovered quite nicely, but it can't compare with Ilya. You can't even tell that half their island was blown away by the Kulak's huge rune cannon. We're that far into this, huh? Is this like posts we coding for? Boy. You know that guy who smacked down the Kulik when they attacked the islands? He used to be one of the Knights of Razrael. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, this is this is late game. Old woman, another fine day. Those Kulik have stopped attacking, and now we can live our lives in peace for a change. Alright. Fair enough. So... I guess back streets? Move. Yes. I don't know if I can do this. Yeah, he's older, all right. Maybe about three years older. Hmm, how did I guess? Don't worry, it's been a while. Just remember what I taught you. I'll try. Back streets. This is where we're fighting. <laughs> Kill them all, lose them all. Alright. Oh, a lightning elemental. Okay. This is seriously it? It's three furballs? I mean, I guess our characters, we only have two of them and they kind of suck, so there you go. Landark's alright, but Kirill, well, let's hope he's better than he used to be. Thunder Runner. Wow. I really should check the enemy's particular affinities before I start doing something like that. But the poison killed that one, didn't it? Whatever. Let me just see what these things are. Yeah, wind, water, wind. Got it. What is my element? Okay, I'm fire. Hmm, yeah. Let's just get over here. Uh, I do have a rune. I forgot I have the flying swallow, but I'm just gonna punch something. Take that. Get out of here. And you're done, buddy. And now I gotta wait. But I got loads of experience. Yes! Also, I should look into positioning my characters a little differently. And there's a treasure chest here, too. So I gotta look into that as well. But oh no, a back attack. Which actually kind of stings, which I'm less than pleased about. That's a fire elemental, so this should be great for my character. One. Get out of here, buddy. Um... 
I'm actually afraid to stand anywhere near that guy, so you know what I'll do? Is I will position myself. I can't get behind this guy, so I'll just stand here and be pleased and attack him from the side. There you go. Stop attacking me. Yes! And I heal. Move. Attack. You're done, buddy. And now I'll heal. Excellent, he says. Oh, I... Hmm. I guess it would have been a little too easy otherwise, right? At some point, I'm going to have to kill these elementals, too. Alright, check this out. Move. Talk. Is there something wrong, Kirill? Uh, not really. If there is, please let me know. I will help as best as I can. Gotcha, thanks. You shouldn't overdo it either, Andark. No, no, it's my duty to assist you, Kirill. Yay, goodwill. I don't have a talk command. I guess that was good for both of us. Um... That one elemental... I think I'm just going to stand here. Unfortunately. Here we go. Hopefully I can handle this. And hello there, Cheeseburger. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? Uh, this game sort of has a sequel, right? Like, Suicoden 4, kind of? Which is also a prequel? We completed the pre-Suicoden 4 segment, and now it looks like we're at either late game or post-Suicoden 4 segment, so I don't know. I'm going to flank this guy. Oh, come on. Finish the job. Got him. Holds of XP. I like this. Furball got a cheap shot in, but I'll, I'll deal with that. Elemental just goes where it pleases. I'm going to have to stop that elemental. That also stings. Alas, alack. Move. Behind. Attack. That guy. Oh, damn. You're done. Yes! Yeah, I can only attack immediately in front of me. Let's move. If it's the wrong element, will it hurt me? Or does it have to be the opposing element? Let's find out. Excellent. Alright, now we're good. So for lightning, I just have to watch out for wind, I suppose. That hurt more than it had a right to. Disappointing amount of damage, but the furball is sitting on its preferred element. Cooperative attack. Cohort attack. Or maybe I can't do it. <laughs> Oh no, that's with Seneca, I'm not even thinking. Alright, this will not kill, unfortunately. But it's damage. I'm not going to get a spectacular rank on this one, I don't think. Can you believe it? I should stand in lightning. It would be embarrassing if I straight up die in this mission. <laughs> You're out of here, buddy. Medicine, hey. Annoying that I can't catch that elemental, but I'll at least heal on the way. 
Yeah, if Mr. Fire Elemental wants to come back, I'm okay with that. Ugh, give me a break. I think he'll come back around, though, so I'll just stand by and heal again. You can go over here. All right. Done with the elemental. Yes. Yeah, he's coming back. Big mistake, buddy. I'm actually curious. I'm not going to bother with the chest. The chest has a guard robe. I'm not overly enthusiastic. All right, we're done. Lightning Spirit Fragment. Hooray! More healing. I did it. What, are you freaking kidding me? I got an S for this? All right. I got a Razril Knight token. Wow. Wow. All right. By the way, one thing I should point out about S rankings is that you get these items once. Like, if you do a new game plus, you can't get them again if you've already gotten them. So that's great. I gotta look up what that is. That was easier than I thought. You're not kidding. What about you, Kiro? How do you feel? So far, so good. But... Forgive me if I speak out of place, but... It seems you haven't fully recovered your strength yet. You're only up to D rank. You're right. I'm still a bit... But that doesn't mean I'm not impressed with your ability. You're a lot bigger and stronger than you were just a couple of years ago. Walter would be proud. If only I had been more careful back then. I'm sorry, Kirill. That was years ago. Forget about it, Andark. No. I did something unforgivable. I must devote the rest of my life to make up for that terrible... Look, I said forget about it, okay? Hey, over there. Seneca's back. Huh? Why all the long faces? And dark. Don't tell me. You started apologizing to him again, didn't you? Hey, this is a serious matter here. I was explaining how guilty I felt and... and... Oh, geez. Here we go again. So, what'd you find out, Seneca? Well, it seems something's up. And it involves rune cannons. Something's up? Involving rune cannons? Yeah. Rumor has it that rune cannons are just disappearing left and right. What? That's impossible. Could it be that the hero in Suicoden 4 is buying them for a ship? Carol, how about heading for Middleport? I think we can get more information there. Good idea. Let's go right away. Besides, we need some more cash. More cash? Oh, we did a small job through this lady in Middleport. Furball Patrol. Yep. Oh, and yeah, Cheeseburger, I have heard of the, uh, the PSP Suicoden game you're talking about. A uh, woven web of a century. That is interesting to me. I, I would like to play all the Suicodens. I've played Japanese exclusives before. I did both of the Suico Gaiden games, and I at least took a stab at the, what, what is it, the the card-based game, the, like, the version of Suicoden 2. So I would like to look at the PSP game if I could. Really? I didn't think you were ready, Carol. I'm fine. Anyway, let's get going. We should still be able to catch a boat to Middleport. And, uh, Magnum, you might have misremembered. You thought there were platinum medals. I think S is as good as it gets, but those are really hard to get. I, I didn't exactly speedrun that stage, so I'm guessing I got an S because 
I kept wailing on enemies and I was low level, so I was just getting experience hand over fist. That's what I assume happened. Um, otherwise... Oh, okay, I went to burn your saying. The Razrael Knight token is an accessory that adds 5 strength, 3 defense, 10 HP. That, that sounds pretty delicious. A good S rank reward. Otherwise... I guess I could depart. That's really all there is to do, right? I'm assuming... Oh, this is the Rune Master. Thank I'm assuming you. this is the same stuff. Welcome. Yeah. Bye. Thank you. I... Hmm. I should probably save before I depart. I might have the opportunity to save anyway, but I'm going to play this safe. Alright, let's depart. Ooh, look at this. Oh, what? I can just go to a different place. This is the big world map. This is great. Razrael. Oh. Oh, look at that. Razrael has an item store, or I guess an armory, and a rune shop. Middleport has those things as well, and a blacksmith. And exclamation? I don't know if that means like a side thing, like when I hit up the gossip in the first place we were in. But let's take a look. Oh, they count the days. Huh. Hey, Andark. Yes? I was just thinking, why do you suppose my father was so determined to track down rune cannons? Oh yeah, in Winterburn, regarding, hey, I would like to try playing the PSP game, and you're like, you mean purchase a legitimate copy? Joke's on you, I actually did import a legitimate copy. Too bad I don't know Japanese, so I, I feel guilt-free emulating it. You and the others probably know a lot more about my father's work than I do. Well, Walter was... He was an engineer. An engineer? <gasps> That's right. He was a brilliant engineer who helped design rune cannons back at our homeland in the Scarlet Moon Empire. It's still we weird um, hearing about the Scarlet Moon Empire. He was so devoted to his research that he decided to come here and study the rune cannons of the island nations. If he had only stayed away, that catastrophe would never have... Okay, okay, Andark. But an engineer, huh? He must have been pretty smart. I have a lot to live up to. Carol, you still remember the promise you made to your father, don't you? Yeah, but it's not just that. I want to learn about rune cannons for myself. I want to see with my own eyes whether the weapon that killed my father really was a rune cannon. Yeah, well, th that's the whole thing, isn't it? Like, you remember rune cannons from Suicoden 4? They're cannons. They're just cannons but they shoot magic instead of standard cannonballs this was like a weird eye thing like what the hell and after you find out then i'm gonna smash the damn thing to bits and avenge my father i'm with you all the way and andark too right andark Oh, Overlord Mao, Kirill's voice actor, did Izzy from Digimon. That's kind of funny. I have not seen that show, so I did not know. But it's it's like it's always weird hearing those little connections like that. Like that, that that's me with Steve Blum. It's like, oh, I know you from other things. I shall dedicate the rest of my life. Yeah, yeah, we get it. Here's your reward. Thank you very much. Stop by anytime, okay? Lalako? Oh, and by the way, I've opened up an office. Oh, yeah. Okay, I think that this, maybe this is what the exclamation point meant. I think this is quests. Really? Your own office? Yep. 
I've been getting a lot of commissions lately, so I just thought, what the heck, and opened one up. So, from now on, if you're ever in need of something, you know where to look. Gotcha. We'll go right to your office next time. Oh, one more thing. You haven't had any commissions involving rune cannons lately, have you? Rune cannons? Hmm. Don't recall anyone mentioning one of those. But you know, when it comes to rune cannons, that Iskus guy over that way is an expert on them. Iskus, huh? Okay, thanks. We'll head over there right now. Well, good luck. Oh, hey, and don't forget to stop by my office. Hey, Andark. An engineer? Why'd you tell him that? I didn't think I could properly explain it. Sorry. Yeah, you're probably right. Three hundred bucks. But yeah, I should be able to do quests now. I probably don't have many that I can do, but the option exists. What lies beneath the surface? Why, hello. Can I help you? Iskas? Yes. We heard you're an expert on rune cannons. Rune cannons, you say? Ah, uh, I wouldn't say I'm an expert, but I do collect them. Have you heard about how all the rune cannons in this town suddenly disappeared? Yes, the rumors say... Those rumors are true. It's a huge problem. It's kind of nostalgic hearing this theme again. It seems there aren't any materials to make them, or even builders who know how to. That's why I'm gathering together all the remaining rune cannons I can find. Why? Are you collecting them? He literally said he collects them. Well, I know some folks that'll pay a lot of money to get their hands on them. Let's just leave it at that. <laughs> So, what can I do for you today? Are you here to buy or sell? Neither, actually. We were just doing some research. Ah, research, hmm? In that case, I might have some information for you. Really? What? Well, all you have to do is... So that's it, huh? Head to the underground path you mentioned? That's right. You might find some clues to the rune cannon mystery there. And if you happen to find any rune cannon materials down there, please sell them to me. I'll be waiting. Okay, sounds good. Got it. We'll go check it out. Works for me, honestly. Damn, look at this. Look at this menu. Now, I actually do have something that I want to take care of. I'm not sure if I can yet. I might need to buy stuff. Equipment. Yeah, we're buying. Let's enter middle port. I'm going to do something a little weird if I'm able to do it. Oh, uh, where would I do this? Outfitter? Yeah, okay. Flame Force Beat. I'm buying three of them. Thank you. Caravan. I do forget that I have those flame or those various force beads. I can push elements. Anyway, equipment. Kiril. Three. Four. Five. He has five flame force beads equipped. Um, and dark. Maybe he could put on that night token. 
Oh yeah, and there's also the silver medal too. Um, the Naito, look at that, that's serious. But then again, defense plus three is good, but attack... But uh, he probably will need it though, because he only gets one shot with his Thunder Runner. And I suppose I could put... Yeah, I'll give, I'll give Seneca a minor boost. Maybe I should give her the Night Token, honestly. I probably should, actually. Let's do that. Silver Metal is better than Gold Metal, though, which is kind of funny. Gold Metal... Defense plus one, Silver Metal. Still, alright, whatever. Anyway, let's let's give Seneca the night token. Boom. That that's really good. Okay, so why in the world do I uh well Hmm. I guess I'll set myself up. I'm gonna save, and I will try a certain something maybe once. Because I don't have too much time, but I'm going to try this. I'm going to try this. Let's go back to Middleport. Let's go to the Quest Guild. Welcome. These are the quests we have for someone of your rank, Kiro. Game on. It's Rita. I've thought up a new game and would really like to find someone to play it with me. I'll be waiting in the back streets of Razrail. Hope to see you there. You accept that quest? Great, we're counting on you. Okay, I'm on it, I say. Reward 500 bucks, 1,000 skill points. Oh no, 1,500 bucks and 1,000 skill points. Although I have to pay 100 to get in, so eh. Play Rita's new game with her. So can I just go? Can I just go there? How do I actually go there? Oh right, because I'm in the wrong place, aren't I? Depart. It's gonna cost me a day? It's so weird. But it's really cool that I can do this. Enter Razrail. How do I go to the back streets? This is Depart, I don't want to do that. How do I do this? Gossip? Oh, Rita, okay. Okay, hey there. You're here to play my game, right? Let's get right to it. The rules are simple. Whoever ends up with more of their affinity element after five moves wins. In other words, you have to change terrain elements as fast as you can. But if you attack me, you lose. Let's get started. You'll get the hang of it. This is so bizarre. So remember Rita, she's the girl who invented Mahjong. <laughs> More fire terrain than lightning after five turns. Do not attack Rita, for the love of God. Alright. Hang in there. Try to spread the fire element terrain, but I'm warning you, I don't intend to lose. I will try this once. So... Item. Flame Force Speed. I probably should have moved first, but whatever. I suppose I could attack the uh, the elementals, <laughs> like the lightning ones. Okay, now I gotta deal with that. But now I have these elementals, which could really just ruin everything, see? Like, that sucks. But we got the fire one, so who the hell knows. Yeah, I think... I need to kill the lightning elementals. Now for my second move. Hmm. I'll definitely win if I could keep this up. Oh, 
flame force speed. Let's see what I'm gonna get. This is really not ideal. I might lose this. If I, I mean, whatever the case, I'll, I'll end the stream afterward. But I'm gonna try to win this. My fire elementals are not doing the best job. She keeps retreating and using more. Ugh. My fire elementals are doing a terrible job. The purple ones, like, actually seem to want to cover the, the ground. Now for my third move. Come on, try harder. I'm hoping for the best here. <clears throat> Doesn't matter which way I face. I, re I really need to like somehow kill the the lightning elemental. This is the worst. I think she's got this in the bag. But maybe the fire ones are coming around, possibly? Because that, that purple one really wasted his turn, so maybe I'll be lucky. But that fire one also really wasted his turn. And this purple one is just doing what it wants in Rita's territory. Huh? What's wrong? Only two more moves left. Hang in there. Or do I need to go easy on you? You can go easy on me. I'll, I'll, I'll take the the dishonor if I can just get this done. Ugh, she's cleaning up. Yeah, could the fire elemental- thank you. If the other fire elemental could do something, that'd be great, because the, the Rita's lightning elementals are really just cleaning up. Come on already, just make your move. Or are you trying to rub it in? Well, whatever, I don't care about this stupid game anyway. How ironic. Anyway... I gotta move. Let's hope for the best. Now I just gotta hope that her lightning elementals do nothing and my fire elementals flip out. Oh yeah, she can cover my areas. That's unfortunate. We'll see who won, but I do not have the highest of hopes for my own things. C rank. Did I actually win it? Bronze medal, I mean, whatever. Did I get it? Huh? I lost? I don't believe it. I'll be honest with you, I don't either. This calls for some hardcore training. I'll have to play a lot more. Of course you'll help me, right? I'm counting on you. Yeah! I got a recruit! How do you like that? That's how it's done. So, um... Bye. It begins. Enter Middleport. And now let's go to the Quest Guild and actually report my success. Welcome. Game on. What do you have to report? Let's see. Beat Rita. All oh, right, I did it. Okay, that quest is complete. 1500 bucks, so I got it on top of actually winning the match, which directly paid me. And a thousand skill points! Who the hell could say no? Did it. Yeah, so now I can actually do the other quests. Rita's was the only one that was open, and now you know you better have enough flame beads to do the quest. But now we got how uh, all this stuff. So, there's the actual plot. And there are going to be side quests, which is super cool. I now have that as an option. So, um, 
I like the thing is though, I am informed that now that I have Rita, I can do these quests, but until I like build up her stats, I might not do very well at those quests. So I might need to actually advance the game for a little while. For now though, I'm gonna enter the caravan. And system menu. There we go. We have done it. So this is where I'm going to wrap up the stream. So thank you very much for watching, everybody, and have a wonderful night.